Another day, another report that a major league sports owner is unhappy with his stadium and may be looking for greener pastures. This time it is Jerry Reinsdorf, the owner of Major League Baseball's Chicago White Sox. Crane's Chicago Business reported that Reinsdorf would consider moving his team out of his present Chicago stadium when his lease expires in 2029. According to Crane Chicago Business, Reinsdorf could build a new stadium somewhere else in the city, move to a Chicago suburb, or to Nashville. Reinsdorf could also sell the team. Reinsdorf also knows that elected officials in some of Chicago suburbs are actively courting the National Football League Chicago Bears ownership to move its business to their town. Reinsdorf had his public relations department refute the story with one caveat. We have not had any conversations about our lease situation, team spokesman Scott Ryford told Cranes. With six years remaining, it is naturally nearing a time where discussions should begin to take place. The conversations would be with the city, ISFA, and the state, and most likely would be about vision, opportunities, and the future. In the late 1980s, Reinsdorf played the stadium game, pitting the city of Chicago the state of Illinois against St. Petersburg to land Reinsdorf's business not long after a 1986 change of the United States tax code. Under the right set of circumstances, an owner could walk out with 92 cents out of every dollar spent inside the stadium and or an arena, including parking lots, with the local municipality paying most of the tab for the structure and having to find other revenue sources to pay down the venue debt as getting eight cents out of every dollar was not enough for the local municipality to pay down the building debt. Reinsdorf is back in the stadium game. I'm Evan Wiener.